Last minute uh, Christmas gifts and some tips for your pets over this holiday season because, you know, they're involved and they can get stressed out too. Yeah, I've got a few tips. One of them is going to be if you have a separate room uh, to put any cats and dogs that you have in the room because it's kind of stressful on the little critters mm -hmm. if there's a lot of company over, which is, you know, being the holidays there right. usually is. Um, another thing too is uh, if there's any chocolate around, uh, keep that no away from no <laughs> treats. Sorry, no treats for the cats and dogs because it's it's not very good for them as well as uh, poinsettias. Uh, putting the, those plants up away uh, from the animals. Right. And uh, if people are in the, in the tradition of putting uh, decorations while the whole family is together, I would recommend that tinsel be put on the top part of the tree rather than the bottom. So cats. <laughs> I was telling you about my cat that eats it every year and then yeah. puke numerous yeah. times. <laughs> And then what we have That's here, what we have here is a few uh, last-minute gift ideas, both for people and mm -hmm. for the pets. We've got what here. What pets do you have here? Uh, we got a Siberian hamster, yeah. and you can see him just going just crazy in the wheel. Yeah, just, yeah, just little, little tiny guys. As well, we got a beta kit here. Uh, it's got the beta in there, and which it's, is a, a, Jeff, er, it's a Siamese, Siamese fighting, fighting fish. fish. A Siamese right? fighting fish. That's right. Uh, for the dogs, we got some Christmas Kongs and various sizes and, sh and colors. What do those do? Uh, it's, it's chew toys. Oh, chew toys. Chew there toys. Yeah. I don't know all these pet terms. For uh, some other of the animals, like my hat here, for... <laughs> if it looks both small brave. <laughs> you got uh, some little antlers for the dogs, uh, some larger ones and some little small ones. Uh, for the cats, we got the uh, kitten mitten. A kitten mitten? A kitten mitten. You put on your hands like a glove <laughs> right. and you play with your cats. It's a lot of fun <laughs> for both the owner and the animal. Uh, for the stocking, we got some stocking stuffers to put up on, oh, good. on the, uh, the mantle. And for the other little rodents, we've got the, that? it's it's a rodent potty. <laughs> well, <laughs> really, they need one really, too. <laughs> really neat Christmas idea for those little gaffers. And for the reptiles, we've got uh, Christmas crickets and Christmas <laughs> snails and Christmas can of worms and Christmas grasshoppers, great gift ideas if you go so don't, to So don't mix them up with your other stocking stuffers for the uh, <laughs> human right. on your foot. That's right. Well, those are some great ideas. Um, and, and Petland, of course, is open in other stores around to get this kind of stuff. Yep, we're open today at 5, actually, and we'll be open again on Boxing Day. And on Boxing Day. Mm -hmm. All right, right on. There's a number to call if you do want some more info, 976-869-90. And can we, oh, this guy's starting to run now. I was going to say, can you can you pull him out of there? Because, I mean, you can buy these whole cases for these. Yeah. They're just tiny. I just wanted to show people because they can't really tell what they look like. Let's take the little gaffer. Can you see him? He's got red eyes. There he is. So the idea, pets or pet gifts, because you have to remember yeah. your pets too, I suppose, don't yeah. you? That's right. Great. Well, thank you very much for coming on and have yourself a Merry Christmas. You're too. Good. And you might be busy on Boxing Day. <laughs> now, here's a heartwarming story we all like to hear at this time of year. Here, I'll give this to you. A young boy is actually alive today because of what his parents are calling a Christmas miracle. After a frightening fall from an upstairs bedroom, doctors could find nothing wrong with little Joey Vogel. His family believes they know the reason why. Anne Marshall has their remarkable story. Well, 